India is considered a pretty reliable source of information around the world on the internet. It's free, it's used by millions of students when they can't be bothered with working on their actual projects and usually it's accurate at least. But sometimes there are articles on Wikipedia that seem useless or at least unusual and that's what we're going to be looking at today. Here are a few unusual articles that are listed on Wikipedia. If you like this video, make sure to like, subscribe and comment down below what kind of videos you want to see in the future. And let's get on with the video. If we go on to the website Wikipedia Unusual Articles, here's what we'll see. Here are a few criteria. The article is something a reasonable person would not expect to find in a standard encyclopedia. It's a highly unusual concept, combination of concepts such as a cosmic latte, death from laughter, etc. A cosmic plot is the average color of it, the universe. Okay. Or the subjects are clear anomaly, something that defies expectations, common sense, etc. It's well documented for unexpected not notoriety or an unplanned cult following at extreme levels, such as, I won't even bother, the symbol for pedestrian science. Okay, that's really. It's a notorious hoax, it's found amusing even if it's serious, apparently, distinct among other similar subjects, or it's a collection of articles that meet these criteria. There's no precise or absolute criteria for this. Some articles can be considered unusual even if they don't fit this. Yeah, makes sense. So here are the contents. Let's start with names in biology, that sounds like it will be confusing and there's there's a beetle named after Hitler and Anne of Thalmus Hitler rare blind beetle, beetle named after Hitler quotes by colors of hit collectors of Hitler memor memorabilia that that just sounds exactly how bad as it probably is how does it look actually uh, yeah does, it, does that deserve to be named after possibly the worst person of all time? Next one is, there's a crab named after Harry Potter, called Harry Plum. It's an entire genus of crabs, apparently. It's the sole species of the genus is named after the coldly hostile yet em emotion-concealing ca character from the same franchise. Coldly hostile yet emotion-concealing. Now exactly the first words I describe Harry Potter as. <laughs> Why? Mothers against de decapentaplegic. That, that's a protein? What? Oh, that, that entire name is a protein. Yeah, that, that... Okay, the phrase before decapentaplegic is just added on. There's a extracellular matrix like retinal protein named after Pikachu <laughs> of course it is zombie taxon the paleontology of the undead wait so they they study bones of the undead that that makes no sense wait surely that's just murdering a zombie taxon washed out sediments or that Zombie taxon refers to a fossil washed out of sediments and redeposited in the rocks. And our sediment millions of years younger. A mistaken interpretation of the age leads to its title. And that the discovered fossil was at some point mobile or walking despite the organism being long dead. So basically the fossil was alive but the actual organism of the fossil was dead. Yeah, it's not as interesting as it could have been. Next, let's see. Uh, let's go with probably history. That could either be horrifying or very entertaining. And then let's see. There's a Wikipedia article about an elephant. And then a, a dancing plague of 1518. Around 400 people took to dancing for days without rest and over the period of about one month, some of them affected died of heart attack, stroke or exhaustion. F 400 people in 1518. 
this is for an entire month decided to dance for what is the reason for this what sequel to step up is this the great stink a london summer so smelly it prompted government action <laughs> right here 18 1858 as well so that that is anyone has all the most of this glass delusion believing oneself to be made of glass was quite in vogue among the renaissance era european nobility they wanted to be so special they decided they were made of glass let's see what this dancing play of 1518 modern theories it's either food poisoning what kind of food is this air cut fungi grows commonly on grains oh it's related to the drug lsd yeah that yeah i guess that makes sense okay oh, yeah, never mind john walter argues that it doesn't seem tenable as it's unlikely could have done for that they could have done for days at the time nor would men so many people re- react to it in the same way okay never mind stress induced mass hysteria the great moon hoax an infamous article by the sun that's ironic great moon hoax by the sun of course it is that claim that animals such as unicorns and bat-winged humans were f- found living on the moon bat-winged humans surely they aren't humans they have bad wings like that that's kind of hands are a pretty essential part of being human london beer f- everything's in england or something the london beer flood nine people drowned by a flood of 300000 gallons of beer okay now defenestration of prague when was that someone got thrown out of a window and that started a war no one i mean can you blame him, to be fair more the next topic Let's see plan technology technology pop culture etc sports like eh, what else is the question wikipedia is not afraid to tackle the tough question how how many angels can dance on the head of a pin what that's so specific for somebody that yeah if a tree falls in a forest oh yeah that's the does it make a sound and shit where's the beef is this a wendy thing Wikipedia is throwing shade at them. In 1984, people thought this was really funny for some reason. And why did the chicken cross the road have a Wikipedia article for some reason? Next is lists. List of common misconceptions. Yeah, that's probably going to be a good good enough video. I'm saving that. Lists of Danish football transfers. What? It's not just a list. It's a list of lists. Oh my. Yeah, that makes sense. Lists of, list of lists of lists. Of, someone had to make that. So, someone has to moderate that. Let's move on to, let's see, music, I guess. Nah, film. 100 years. What is this? Oh, these are just names of films. How about space and astronomy? That should be interesting enough. Cause the glad day. Yeah, they are. they talked about that the average color of the universe the tesla roadster that was shot into space fair enough a small fallen astronaut a small statuette which is the only sculpture on the moon oh oh it's just like what it's not even 10 centimeters it's like a toy actually they've kept on the moon oh it it commemorates the dead <laughs> as you might see yeah, not the best thing to laugh at isn't it Na- Nazi US first did the Luftwaffe Luft that thing in fact explore the final frontier and make contact with alien races whether the secret Nazi base is on the moon or in Antarctica the truth is apparently out there what <laughs> they couldn't even bother with human races and they couldn't go with alien races sex in space of, of course that's a big video article What is this? What is actually the question? But how would you have sex in space actually? Embryo space colonization. 
a proposal for colonizing space using embryo space by robots that that just sounds like the definition of a dystopian nightmare surely like how has nobody thought about the fact you are going to leave like unborn children in, in the hands of actual robots let's go with probably maths i guess 0.9999 there's an infinitely long way to write one of of course there 2 2 plus 2 is equal to 5 what Oh, it's used in 1984. Of course it is. Then, a mathematical joke. Complex numbers are all fun and games until someone loses an eye. That's when, that's when things get real. That, that actually has a Wikipedia article. Of course it is. Sexy prime. Prime numbers that differ from each other by sex. or uh, six that that is actually you cannot be telling me mathematicians have bothered with this no of course they have let's just move on from that into probably festivals i guess very less of these Ka- kanamara matsuri a phallus festival in kawasaki japan there's There is a festival about dicks uh, in Japan. Do, do I want to search this? Not really. Mexico City Alabrije Parade. Parade and con- colorful monster. What do these look like? This is... What is... They just look like toys again. They made an entire parade about it. Testicle festival. Of, of course there is. Where is this? You went to hell. It's held at several small towns for the feet. The featured activity is the consumption of animal testicles. You usually battered and f- fried. Oh. What the hell is this? I, the name was better than what it is. Toy piano festival. Just, it's just people playing it, isn't it? Of course it is. Who is this? Spider-Man Turn Off The Dark. At 75 million, the most expensive Broadway musical, infamous for its double production history and cast member accidents, also holds the record for largest number of preview showings before op- official opening. What? 182 preview showings. At that point, who else is going to watch it? Like, it's 75 million for a musical. In theatre. And yeah. Next up, let's go with unusual names. This should be good. In Argel Fax, a Brazilian footballer with a socially problematic last name. A unforgettable newspaper headline once declared, Fax off to Benfica. <laughs> of course. <laughs> a, a, B, C, D, E. 328 people were named this in the US between 1990 and 2014. Of course, then. Lazy bastard. The least creative parents of these 328 people. Cox Zucker Machine. The <laughs> An algorithm named after its inventors. Surely you'd use your first name at that point. Like, at least hear it. De- Deportivo Vanka. <laughs> An unfortunately named Peruvian football team whose trips are remarkably popular in Britain. Of course there are. Take ass, man. <laughs> yeah, th- we have gotten into the good part of this. Adolf Lew Hitler Marak. Th- this Indian politician does not disgrace his parents' questionable name choice. How, how does he? John, be good enough. <laughs> Being good enough, he invented random, a- he invented random access memory and lithium ion battery. Surely that's a lot more than good enough, considering that he's like, what, 200 years later or something. I'm a hog. <laughs> that, that's actually a name. I'm the society leader, philanthropist, patron and collector of the arts. One, one of the most respected women in Texas <laughs> during the 20th century. Fantastic. Let, what the fuck is this? Let, do I need... Lulf, Yudvalo, Odin, Nestor, 
Egbert, Lionel, Todd, Mark, Hugh, Air, 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 Kevin, Sachs, and Esther, Cromwell, Orman, Apple. These are tall Marsh. Leon's older brother, who's, whose initials stand for Lionel the second. How people really do anything? That, that's all you need to know. Naming Lawrence. Oh, that's not. That's not an actual name. I thought naming Lawrence Reed and somebody named that child. That's just setting up for bullying. But an odd Swedish law is regulating children's names, which has led to disgruntled parents submitting names such as the A Metallica and the. How how does the name have numbers in it? What? Like the f- ne- Neville Neville, the father of Phil and Gary Neville. That is that actually his name? He was, he was a cricketer, football agent, and director as well. So it's it's not even like he was some random guy who just did, had this. He was actually famous and. Tiny Cox is an actual name. <laughs> An, a Dutch politician. <laughs> oh god. Some of these people. Ro- Roger fucked by the neighbor. What? <laughs> Perhaps the first use of the word fuck as well. <laughs> That's his biggest achievement. After being caught. Wait, so this is just... Oh, it's part of... The actual <laughs> Wikipedia of the word fuck. It was some random guy's name. Pub- Public Universal Friend is the actual name of someone. Who, was, who died, was revived, became an evangelist, and then got this name. One of the earliest hist- instances of someone identifying as gentleness. I mean, <laughs> Public Universal Friend. Yeah, and I had hoped he was. Pro-life is an actual... Wait. Is that? Yeah, it actually is. Oh, he's changed his name just for his... What is it? Political views. That shit. Tokyo sex one. This, despite not being Japanese or a sperm whale, he has control over the global di- global diamond industry. Businessman, politician, anti-apartheid activist. And... Oh yes, so he's actually impressive as well. John LaFucker. Fan- fantastic. Yeah, that's probably enough for today. That's gonna be it from me, guys. Thank you all for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below what you want to see in the future. But I'll see you guys next time.